Hey guys, welcome back to Africa. And ever since we unlocked this 30 out 6, I've been absolutely just loving this rifle. I mean, this thing takes down lions, Cape Buffalo, Wildebeest. So that there was a 250 yard double lung heart shot on that lioness. So we happen to have a nice little Cape Buffalo here. It's a six hard and he's about 100 yards out. We're gonna see what the 30 odd six can do on this one. I guess pretty good. And skull and brain at 100 yards out. So you can see the 30 odd six does just fine on the Cape Buffalo as well. Well, we got a pretty nice wildebeest right there at about 150 out. So we'll see if he slows up here for us to get a decent shot. And you can see how he is quartering like that. You don't want to take that angle if at all possible. Kind of want to wait till he turns. There we go. Now he should stop. Come on. Or he's going to go right into the brush. <laughs> Are those springbok? Holy herd of springbok. It's a good one there. Let's find that wildebeest. There he is. We'll have to go for a walking shot and I think we hit a little bit too far back on him. But he still smoked apparently. <laughs> oh my god, that's a giant! Look at that Gemsbach! Holy, I've never seen a Diamond Gemsbach and that's gotta be a Diamond Gemsbach. There, there's no doubt about it. Look at the size of the horns on that thing. Man. Okay, so I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna set up a tripod here and wait until... Oh, there she is right there. Wow. That thing is huge. Let's see, where are they going to come to? It looks like right about there. She's only like a hundred out, but I'm wondering if she's going to stop somewhere. I don't have a need zone here, so unless that stop, yes. Okay, so she should stop right about there. Hopefully. And there we go. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Why did she have to stop right behind that bush? I don't trust the rangefinder. 100 yards out. Whew. Well, I guess we're going to try and spot her. And she smoked! Whew. I thought we might have hit a little bit too low. I was holding low because she was a little closer than 150. And I saw everything run and I saw her, she was still kind of standing but yet not quite and she tipped over whoo let's go over and go take a look man that is definitely the biggest gemsbok i've ever seen and there she lays probably not gonna be oh it's a gold <laughs> how is that a goal of 927 man Oh, wow. I mean, she was literally just so moped. Double lung heart and went through the shoulder. Wow, that I thought we hit low, but <laughs> that was perfect. 927. 328. I still think this is my biggest one so far. Oh, well, still an awesome shot. So let's go over here now and pick up our wildebeest. This wildebeest has potential to be a pretty nice one as well. Hey, 
It is a pretty nice one. Double lung shot, and we got 100% at 155 yards out. You can see I didn't quite lead it enough, but I was still a little bit too high there. 899 gold. Very nice. I'm happy with that. Man, it's really amazing how when you try different times of the day, you find so many different animals that you haven't seen before. Because I've gone here several times during Lion Drink Zone, which is 12 o'clock. And I never see anything here. Now it's a little bit earlier. It's 1040 in the morning. And there's animals everywhere. We got Springbok. We got Wildebeest. That's a pretty good sized track there. Probably going to be like a nice gold. And we have Gemsbok. The only thing we don't have is Lion. But I'm not really looking for Lion. Okay, so you guys remember when we came over here and took down the entire herd of Warthogs? Well, we're in the exact same spot and look at all the Warthogs. There's still probably another 20, 25 warthogs here. Last time we came here, we took down 15 of them. And now there's still at least 20 more warthogs. So I don't know if we ended up taking down the whole entire herd and they all came back or if we barely put a dent in the herd. Maybe there was like 60 warthogs in the one herd and now there's only 20 left. But I mean, 20 is still a lot of warthogs here. That's a ton of warthogs and actually that is a really nice four right there i think we're gonna go for him about 220 yards out but this time we have a little more firepower that'll do that'll do Oh, what's interesting about this spot is there's actually some Cape Buffalo over here as well. I've never seen Cape Buffalo here before, but right now there are I think six or seven Cape Buffalo here. There's a pretty nice mythic over there. You can just barely see them. But let me show you where we're at uh, in case you haven't seen last time. Right here is the starting lodge. Just go right to the northwest over here. And the zone is from 830 until 1230. So yeah, there are Cape Buffalo here. But the Warthog Zone is from 8.30 until 12 o'clock as well. So when you come here, you could potentially hunt for two different diamonds at the same time. But I see another Warthog yet over there, so we are not going to pass up the opportunity to take this one. Man, this 30-odd-6 just rocks them. So we'll grab this one first. And that was actually a small male, double lung spinal cord. I thought we might have been a little bit high, 225, but that's all right. We'll grab this one. I think this was a, okay, that was a female. I was going to say, I thought it might have been a three, but that's a double lung at 256. And this one here should be our nice male. He is a gold, 872, double lunged him at 256. Perfect shot on him. And that's a nice warthog. We should probably keep it, but... Yeah, let's keep them. If we can find a spot for them here. Switch out the 933 with the 946. That could work. Well, that's kind of cool. We got an eight mythical lion out there. He's about 180 out. So we'll hold pretty much for the top of the heart for 160. And we should be good. Money. That's a big lion down. We just smoked him at like 190 with a 30 odd six. All right, here he is. Monster lion with a 30 odd six. Let's pick him up. And he's going to score 892 trophy rating of 46. The double lung heart centered perfectly at 220 yards out with a 30 odd six. That was a monster lion and an incredible shot. Well, that's another pretty nice gems box. Could be a diamond, but probably not. I mean, it's still going to be a nice gold. And I'm still not going to use this rangefinder ever again because it's way off. So 200 yards. I would have said like 180. So pretty close. So. Shoot. 
She's down. Man, this thing has like no drop from 150 all the way out to pretty much like 260, 270. It shoots pretty flat. So that's why these tripods are so handy on this map. As you can see, the guns block was right over here and there's no way we would have seen it if we were on the ground. But we set up a tripod right next to the lodge there and I can see over the top, we found this whole uh, herd of guns block over here feeding. And that's how I picked out that monster guns block. Eh, decent sized one. Another gold, 887. See, it is so hard to tell which one or what it's gonna be you know what i mean that was an awesome shot though i thought we hit low again and really that was perfect double lung and heart at 199 yards out wow i love this 30 out six okay guys so that's really cool and all that we're getting some really nice gums back and they're definitely diamond potential but we've still yet to see a diamond gums back and i've yet to get one well that is until a couple nights ago Okay guys, so for this part, I didn't have my audio on. I wasn't planning on recording, but when I found this, I thought it just might be a diamond, but I'm not 100% sure. But at the same time, I want to make sure I at least record it. That way I can get my first ever diamond gums block on video. And so, yeah. Anyway, so what happened here is I managed to sneak up to about 80 yards away from the herd. And here she comes right here we're zeroed in for 80 it was a perfect drop shot and there she lays potentially could be a diamond i don't know i've never gotten one i've never even seen one and there you have it she's a diamond 950 score i'm not like super excited i mean i'm more shocked and stunned i would say that i would have said there was a 7% chance that this was going to be a diamond based off of all the other gems box that I've been seeing <laughs> and it ended up being a diamond so I couldn't actually be there during the moment it took place I mean I was there but I I wasn't recording my audio because I just wanted to make sure that you know the shot would be on video but anyways we ended up getting our first diamond gems box and yeah double long hard shot at 72 yards with the 30 odd six. So I'm pretty happy. I mean, I'm really happy now that I think about it. I've been hunting for a diamond gums buck for so long. Multiplayer, regular maps, never gotten one. And now we finally have one. Well, this is honestly one that I can say that I didn't expect would ever happen. But here she is, our 950 diamond gums buck. And our first diamond gums buck ever and yeah that's gonna be it for this video so i hope you guys enjoyed it thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time